under the head algorithm classifications we are going to discuss brute force algorithm in case of brute force algorithm it will find all possible possibilities to find a satisfactory solution for the problem and that is the basic theme behind this brute force algorithm so see this algorithm simply tries all possibilities until a satisfactory solution is found so that is the main theme such an algorithm can be of two types one is your optimizing another one is your satisfying so optimizing and satisfying so two types of cases are there find the best solution so to do this this may require finding all solutions of the problem or if a value for the best solution is known it may stop when any best solution is found so it will try to find out all possible solutions and it will pick up the best solution out of that otherwise if the best solution is pre known to us then we shall go on finding all the solutions and the, when the best solution will be found then the algorithm will terminate example finding a best path for a traveling salesman to traverse all the cities of a certain zone and all the cities will be traversed once and the total path cost will be minimum so that is a traveling salesman problem so finding the best path for a traveling salesman problem might be falling under this category now what about this satisfying stop as soon as a solution is found that is good enough to get accepted example finding a traveling salesman path which is within 10% of the optimal value so this these are the two types of this particular brute force algorithm let us go for other features so there are some improvements we can suggest often brute force algorithm requires exponential time that means that complexity is too high in those cases various heuristics and optimizations can be used what is a heuristics heuristics means we, we will be having some prior estimates so heuristic means a rule of thumb that helps you decide which possibilities to look at first that means i'm having some heuristic value i'm having some previous estimates using those previous estimates and heuristic values we know that we not know we guess that this is the probable path which we should explore at first that means which possibilities we should look at first explore at first that will be selected through this heuristic in case of optimization in this case a way to eliminate certain possibilities without folding without fully exploring them that means i am not going to explore all the possibilities if you go on doing such then the complexity of the algorithm will be too high so that's why for the optimization we can we may not explore all the possibilities to the fullest extent we may leave them we, we, we may we may may not uh, execute all those possibilities we can we may not test all the possibilities and we can eliminate certain possibilities without fully exploring them so there are two ways in which you can reduce the complexity of brute force algorithm so what is a brute force algorithm what are the improvements can be suggested we have discussed everything i think now the conceptions are getting clear to you thanks for watching this video